Hi YouTube, today I'm opening the Cult Python 357. Here's the front of the box. And here's the back of the box. Okay, now I'm gonna open it. Whoa, this is a nice gun. So it comes with the actual gun. Next, it comes with this little piece of paper that shows other things they sell, their babies, CO2 canisters, and other guns they sell. It comes with a yellow um, safety slip. It comes with a white piece of paper that shows safety rules. It comes with this brown piece of paper that shows other cult models. It comes with this white piece of paper that tells about Umarex and the instructions. It takes 177 caliber, 4.5 millimeter steel BBs. It shoots at 410 FPS. It takes 12 gram CO2 canisters and it holds 10 rounds. Okay, so now we're gonna talk about this gun. This gun is a CO2 gas powered gun. And first, the things you're gonna need from, for this gun. You're gonna need the BBs. You're gonna need the CO2 canister. You're gonna need the right size Allen wrench to open um, the part where you put the CO2 in. And last, you're gonna need this thing called Pelgun oil. Now, now, different brands make this, but Pelgun oil is this oil that prevents CO2 leaking. So this works with this is with most CO2 guns. Before you put the CO2 canister in the gun, you need to pour this a uh, one little drop of Pelgun oil on the top, and then put it in, and that prevents CO2 air leaking. It just kind of seals it up. So now um, the safety switch is uh, is right behind the hammer, which forward is safety, backward is fire. To actually load the BBs, you're gonna push, push this forward and push it down. And then you're gonna pop this piece out. Which once you pop this piece out, there's gonna be this BB holder and you're gonna load all 10 BBs in here. And then you're gonna put this back in and then do this and kind of lock it in there. So it'll be ready. And then there's the sight, the iron sight. So first I'm gonna show you how to put the CO2 canister in. First you're gonna need the right Allen right size Allen wrench and put it at the bottom of the handle and unscrew it. Take this out and save it. And then this whole piece is just gonna pop off. Like this. And you're gonna see this. So next, um, you're gonna take your Pelgun oil and open the cap. And then take the CO2 canister and put one tiny little drop of Pelgun oil on it. That's enough. So about this big of a drop is probably enough Pelgun oil. Then you're gonna put the CO2 canister in here like this. And you're gonna put this in and tighten it. Then you can just like put this cap on. There. So now you're just gonna fire it to make sure it makes it good. Good. Okay. So then you're gonna load the BBs, which I said you pull this forward, push it down, pop this out, and you're gonna take all your BBs. Just take some BBs, like. And you're just gonna put them in these little holes like this. And it holds 10 minutes. So now this thing is fully loaded. So before I put this back in, I'm just gonna show you there's two ways to fire. You can fire like this. Just keep pulling the trigger, or you can pull this back and then fire. And pulling it back and then firing is more accurate. I'd rather do that. But if there's like a lot of people or a lot of bad guys there, you could just fire like that. If they're like right close to you. But if you're going for accuracy, I'd rather pull this back and then fire. 
it, get, it gives it more accuracy. So once you're done loading this, you BB. see how there's two sides, one side where you don't see the BBs much and the other side you see the BBs? You're gonna put the side that you see the BBs front and just put this piece in. So then once you've done that, you do that and it's on safety. So you put it on safety and then go to wherever you're gonna shoot from and put it on fire and shoot. So whenever you're shooting the target, make sure you're not doing it in a public place and there's no people or animals in front of you where you're shooting. So now we need to take my dog away when I'm shooting this. My mom is holding my dog right now so I don't shoot him. Now I'm gonna shoot that target. Can you like aim the light there? Cause it's hard to see. I hit it! The first time in the dark. That's cool, this is an accurate gun. So even though like our lights right there are burned out when you change the lights, I still hit it in the dark, first try. Okay, now I'm going for the middle, a little bit smaller. I hit it! I hit it! The middle! The second try, I hit the middle. Now the third try, the smallest one. Yeah! I hit all three. First try, I hit the big one. Second try, I hit the middle. Third, I hit the small. This gun is the most accurate gun I've ever had. This is so cool. Like, this is a good gun. So I have seven bullets left. So, let's go for the middle again. I hit it! This gun is so cool, it's so accurate. Oh, I love this gun. Okay, let's try again. Yeah! I hit it again, I have five bullets left, five BBs left. This is so cool, I'm hit, I keep hitting it. This is so cool, at night time, that's how accurate this gun is. Five in a row, I never missed so far. I just love this gun. Cool. Okay, let's try again, now the big one. Can you point the light at it? Yeah! I hit it again, I just keep hitting it. The six in a row. This is just so good. Okay, I have four BBs left. Let's try again. Even more far away. I hit it! I hit it! Again! Look, I hit the middle. I could see it in the dark. This skin is just so accurate. It's so awesome. I have three BBs left, but I hit it. Okay, the only one still standing is the big one. We have to try to knock it down with our last three bullets. First shot, the closest next to it, the closest to it. That was an easy one. Now the next shot, more farther away. A little bit harder, but I can probably hit it. Ah, oh, dang it, I missed. Yeah, so far I missed once. Our last shot. We have to hit it one hand to Ah, oh, dang it, I missed. Okay. How did I miss that? Okay. So I loaded 10 BBs in here, and on the first try, I missed two times out of 10 times. So that means I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna load two more BBs to shoot in here. So I'm loading two more BBs, and I'm gonna try and knock it down. Okay, here we go. Last two shots. It turns right. So, I should have it in the light. Okay, so it's very dark right now. It's at nighttime, but I'm gonna try my best. I'm gonna try to shoot the last one left. That big one. Okay, here we go. Yeah! I hit it! My last shot. Look, you see? It was up like this, you see? Then I hit it right, look where the BB went. It's right here in the middle. So I shot pretty good. I shot 12 BBs and I missed three out of 12. So I hit the target nine times, which is pretty good. I, I hit it eight times in a row and then I, I shot one more and I missed and I shot it again and I hit it. So this is pretty much a really great revolver and the most accurate gun I've ever had. So I like this gun a lot. So 
Let me take the CO2 out now. Okay, so that's the end of the video. Bye, YouTube. Thanks for watching, and please subscribe. Peace out.